What's up guys, welcome to Apex. Thanks for tuning in. Today's video is going to be very interesting and useful because we have got a brand new Samsung application or let's call it a feature which can be installed unofficially on your Galaxy phone because this feature may not be available in all the regions right now. And this has been shared by Galaxy Techie on X. He has shared an APK as well which can be installed and this APK is working fine as well on my device. Let me go ahead and uh, demonstrate this to you. But before that, let me take you through his post. He says privacy protection on One UI 8 just got a new icon with slightly faster operation. It can blur or cover up private information including avatars, names, ID numbers, etc. automatically with a single tap. To use it, select any image and click privacy protection in the share panel. Now I'll leave a link for this APK in the description but before you download it, let me show you how exactly this particular feature works. Before that, if you're new here on the channel, be sure to subscribe because we keep posting loads of contents like this, some very useful tips and tricks, update related information, and loads of other news related to Galaxy phones and other stuff. So go ahead, stay updated with your device by subscribing to the channel. And do not forget to download our wallpaper application, Wallverse. There are some beautiful wallpaper categories on the application and we keep uh, adding new wallpapers almost every day. Almost about 10 to 20 wallpapers will be added at least four to five days a week go ahead and download this application. The link is in the description. Now I have already installed the application on this Galaxy S24 Ultra. Now to install the APK, I have left a link in the description. You can go ahead and install it, but that's of course with your own risk. These APKs are usually safe because I've been using it on my devices, but yeah, if you're installing it, it's uh, at your own risk. Now let's go ahead. Let me just show you how exactly this works. Now let me open the gallery application here and I have uh, randomly downloaded a credit card or a debit card uh, image here from Google. Now let's say I'm sharing a screenshot of this. I'll take a screenshot here and tap on share. Now here you go. We have got privacy protection. This is the new feature I'm talking about and this has been there uh, I think in some of the countries but not globally available. So let's go ahead. Let's tap on this privacy protection. Let's see what happens. There we go. It scans this screenshot, this particular image, and it covers these important information. As you can see, the card number has been covered over here. And if you want to blur out more information, you can just tap on that information. You can see it just selects that information instantly. Let me just tap on this as well and this as well. It's working perfectly fine. Let's try some other options here. You can see we've got these blur options to blur that information. You've got color and this blur option and we have got these mosaic option as well and this white patch we have and we have got this icon by tapping on which you'll be able to see the information behind this patch you can see the information is displayed and the moment you lift your finger it will be covered now that is one more option we have and now we can save this or share it right from here or tap on edit this particular page. This is after you blur that information, you can go into the gallery and then edit that particular image or screenshot. And then you can go back to share this particular screenshot. And we also have got this eraser button here. When you tap on that, the blur will be removed from this particular screenshot. Now we do get this privacy protection even without taking a screenshot. As you can see, this is the image. This is not a screenshot here. This is the downloaded image. When I tap on downloaded image and share it, you get privacy protection here as well. When I tap on that, it scans the uh, this particular image and it's saying privacy information not found, tap to obscure text. So sometimes it may not work. Maybe when you take the screenshot, it works better. Uh, let me take the screenshot over here. Now let me tap on share and tap on privacy protection. Yeah, on uh, screenshots, it is actually working better or maybe depending on the image that you are sharing, it will or will not work. But uh, this is how it's working right now on my device. Whenever you are sharing a screenshot or any image which has got sensitive information, it will automatically get scanned with this privacy uh, uh, privacy protection feature and uh, it will disguise or it will cover up those information so that when you share it, it will not be seen by others. So this actually saves time because we don't have to manually, uh, you know, uh, remove those information, sensitive information from the image. It will automatically do it or you can just tap on that information to do that quickly. Uh, we don't really have to take a brush inside the gallery and uh, start, you know, erasing it or something. You can just tap on the information to, uh, you know, disguise it. That's how this feature works. So it's actually a very useful feature. I'm not sure why this has not been made available globally on all Samsung Galaxy devices, but I think Samsung should make this available. But if 
if you are interested in using this feature, the APK link is in the description. You can go ahead and check it out. Thanks to Galaxy Techie for sharing this information with us. This will be really useful for a lot of people out there. Anyways, that's all I want to share with you guys. Thanks for watching. I hope you have already subscribed to the channel. I hope you have also downloaded our wallpaper application Volvers. If you haven't done it already, go ahead, do that and give this video a like as well. Thanks all for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. Cheers. Bye-bye.